Hey, what's going on, friends and family? Thank you for tuning in to another episode of BKL Reviews. And today, we got an early exclusive I'm so excited about. Uh, first and foremost, before we get started, I definitely want to encourage everyone to hit that thumbs up button. It goes a long way. And also, if this is your first time tuning into the channel, please subscribe. It's your best way of staying up to date with the most recent content such as this. So this way, you don't actually miss out on anything. You can also follow me on these social media platforms. And with that being said, with no further ado, let's get into the review. Well, as you can see, this is a Jordan bag. I purchased this item actually from the Jordan pop-up store in Brooklyn at 166 Flatbush. So let's check it out. Well, as you can see, it is a Jordan 1 box. So let's actually see what it is. So today we're doing a review on a pair of Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG with a color scheme of light crimson navy university. And it has a style code of 555-088-606. You already know, for the receipt police, and this pair actually came with some treats, which is pretty cool. If you don't know me, you know I'm big on pens. The Jordan pen that says 166 Flatbush, hashtag we are Jordan. And it also came with a couple stickers here as well. Pretty cool. to say uh, you know this is a definitely a pair that pops as far as colors is concerned but it is nice once you get it in hand if you're not familiar with this sneaker this is the Air Jordan 1 uh, David Letterman uh, Nike slash Jordan brand is giving homage to David Letterman because uh, back in 1986 if I'm not mistaken Jordan's rookie year he actually appeared on the David Letterman show where he was wearing an actual Nike uh, track suit that was in this color, and this bright crimson. Um, and I think the actual collar was uh, either navy or university blue. We got a photo. There you go. So let's check the details out. Well, as you can see, it does come with an extra lace. Pretty cool. The upper ankle area, as all Jordan ones have that wings logo here and like I said the entire sneaker is covered in that bright crimson color but the hints here of the blue kind of reminds me of the Jordan 1 uh, metallic there you go it's the same metallic blue here as well as the Nike swoosh you have a white midsole with white stitching as we move to the toe box uh, you have the perforated hole for breathability I have to say the leather on here is not the best leather, but it is somewhat good. So I can't complain. It kind of reminds me of the Cyber Ones. Um, it does come uh, unlaced, like the Chicago Ones, which is pretty cool. Also, flat navy blue laces. And also at the top of the tongue, you have that Nike Air branding that we all love to see. On the medial side, you can see more of that crimson color, as well as the metallic blue hits as we move to the back heel of the sneaker standard heel with the tab as well as the metallic hits here on the high ankle area the actual insole is definitely nice uh, 
they are uh, giving homage to David Letterman. So the actual insole is a black insole that says on air and it has a microphone at the bottom of it. The actual outsole or the sole of the sneak is pretty standard on every Jordan 1. You have that Nike branding dead center of the sneaker. You know, like I said um, before, this is an early uh, release pair. Um, I think this actual sneaker is set to release April 30th. I was fortunate enough to actually purchase this pair at the Jordan pop-up store here in Brooklyn. Um, this actually is the second time that the Jordan pop-up store um, is here. The last time it was here was during All-Star Weekend, I think back in 2015. So it's definitely nice uh, to have these little pop-up shops and be able to purchase sneakers before release date. Uh, I want to thank everyone for tuning in to another episode of BK Overviews. Uh, definitely want to encourage you to hit that thumbs up button. It goes a long way. And also, if this is your first time tuning into the channel, please subscribe. It's your best way of staying up to date with the most recent content such as this. So this way, you don't actually miss out on anything. You can also follow me on these social media platforms. And we also post videos every Sunday at 12 noon. And once again, I want to thank you for tuning in to another episode of BK Overviews.